If you want to sell physical or digital products on your WordPress blog, this video will show you the best WordPress e-commerce plugins to consider that add store functionality to your site. If you enjoy this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and be sure to hit the bell button to be notified when new videos come out. Now, because WordPress is one of the most popular website platforms in the world, there are literally hundreds of e-commerce plugins available to run your online store. So how do you narrow your choices down? The following WordPress e-commerce plugins have been hand curated and evaluated based on the following criteria. Ease of use, is the plugin easy to get up and running? Functionality, does the plugin offer the e-commerce features you need to sell online? Price, how much does the plugin cost? Third-party apps and integrations, is the plugin well supported by third-party tools and developers? And then finally, is the plugin easy to maintain? Now, now the comparisons in this video are based on hands-on experience running a seven-figure e-commerce store and working with over 4,500 students in my e-commerce course. In addition, my kids currently run an e-commerce store based on WordPress over at kidincharge.com, so feel free to check it out. But ultimately, the right WordPress e-commerce plugin for you depends on your specific needs and your budget. But before you install any e-commerce plugin, you must first ask yourself the following questions. Do you have a good web host? Now, unlike a blog, running an online store can be very resource intensive and many e-commerce plugins can slow down your site dramatically. As a result, a good web host is a must. Now, if you're on a budget, you can start with an inexpensive host like Bluehost and even the cheapest Bluehost plan, which costs $3 a month, comes with a free SSL certificate and will allow you to run a fully functional online store. But overall, if you're on Bluehost, it's gonna be an adequate platform until you hit about 10K visits per month. But once your store exceeds this level of traffic, it makes sense to upgrade to a VPS or a dedicated server like Liquid Web or WP Engine. Now, Liquid Web is actually the service that I use to host all my sites, including my seven-figure e-commerce store. Now, is your WordPress site secure? Now, because you're gonna be accepting credit cards and processing personal information on your site, you need a good security plugin in addition to your SSL certificate. Now, at a minimum, you should install a plugin like WordFence or Security to make sure that you are well protected from malicious activity. You also have to check if your e-commerce plugin is compatible with your version of WordPress. WordPress updates every couple of months, which can create compatibility problems for smaller developers who may not have the resources to keep up. As a result, it is important to choose a plugin that is updated frequently from a company that has dedicated resources for support. You also need to consider whether that plugin has strong third-party dev support. E-commerce is constantly evolving and new features and tools are added every single day. Without the help of third-party software and developers, your online store will quickly become obsolete. So for example, most successful e-commerce stores rely on third-party shipping software, email marketing, SMS marketing, and other tools to grow their sales. If your e-commerce plugin is not compatible with popular third-party tools, it should not be considered. And then finally, you have to ask yourself, does the e-commerce plugin have a strong community? The best WordPress plugins have a strong community of users who can help you troubleshoot common issues. Because you will likely use many plugins on your site, incompatibilities can arise. Now, the easiest way to determine the size and quality of a plugin community is to look at the number of downloads and ratings on the WordPress plugin repository. Make sure you read the two and three star reviews to make sure that the plugin is robust, works as described, and will not break your site. So without further ado, here are my top five WordPress e-commerce plugins. Now, it's important to note that this WordPress e-commerce plugin comparison is primarily for selling physical products online, including dropshipping, print-on-demand, wholesale, and private label. Now, if you're selling digital products like courses, memberships, and communities, a different set of plugins may be required. So e-commerce plugin number one, big commerce for WordPress. Now, if you are not tech savvy and you don't want your online store to slow down your site, the BigCommerce WordPress e-commerce plugin is actually my top choice. The BigCommerce plugin installs a fully featured shopping cart on your blog. It's super fast and it won't bog down your site speed at all. All of your products and transactions are hosted on BigCommerce's servers and you don't have to worry about anything technical at all. BigCommerce takes care of your server uptime, your security, your payment processing, everything. In addition, BigCommerce is well supported by third-party developers and they have a strong user community as well. And the best part, is that you can run your online store in a subfolder instead of a subdomain, which is the main shortcoming with integrating Shopify with a WordPress blog. So for example, your store can be located at yourblog.com slash store instead of store.yourblog.com, which is much better for search engine optimization. Now, even though your store is hosted on BigCommerce's servers, 
customers shop directly on your website, and the integration is seamless. As a result, the BigCommerce e-commerce plugin is a solution that is 100% scalable, and you won't have to worry about the technical aspects of selling online. BigCommerce also offers 24-7 customer support if you ever run into problems. Now, the only downside is that BigCommerce costs money, and the cheapest BigCommerce plan starts at $29.99. So overall, here's how I rate the BigCommerce WordPress plugin on a scale of one to 10, where 10 is the best. Ease of use, I give it a nine. BigCommerce is easy to use and you can get up and running right away. Functionality, 10. BigCommerce offers every features that you need to launch a fully featured online store. For price, I give it a five. The BigCommerce plugin requires paying for a monthly plan based on your revenue. Third-party apps and integrations, I give it an eight. BigCommerce is a popular shopping cart and is well supported by third-party devs. Support and maintenance, I give it a 10. Big Commerce takes care of all the technical heavy lifting for your online store. E-commerce plugin number two is WooCommerce. WooCommerce is the most popular e-commerce platform in the world, and it's free to use, just like WordPress. WooCommerce is open source, which means you get access to the source code and you can fully customize your online store exactly how you want. Now, because WooCommerce is so popular, there are thousands of plugins available that add e-commerce functionality and it's a very well-supported platform by third-party developers. In fact, the main reason why my kids chose WooCommerce for their t-shirt business was because WooCommerce is popular and cheap. Opening their shop costs them less than a couple hundred bucks to start, and they pay zero monthly recurring fees. However, the main downside to WooCommerce is that it can greatly slow down your website. In addition, configuring WooCommerce may require some technical knowledge to set up and design your theme exactly how you want. Now, if you decide to use WooCommerce as your e-commerce platform, you should install the WP Rocket plugin, which will greatly speed up your site. And once your site grows, you will also want to use a dedicated web host like Liquid Web or WP Engine to run your site. Overall, here's how I rate WooCommerce on a scale of 1 to 10, where 10 is the best. Ease of use, I give it a 7. Now, WordPress was not originally designed for e-commerce. As a result, WooCommerce may seem like a bolt-on solution to sell products online. There are many counterintuitive menus and options to choose from, which can be intimidating to new users. For functionality, I give it a seven. Out of the box, WooCommerce has everything you need to start selling online, but it's the bare minimum. Options like gift cards, advanced coupons will require adding plugins, which may cost money. Price, I give it a 10, you can't beat free. Third-party apps and integrations, I give it a 10. Because WooCommerce is so popular, there are thousands of WooCommerce plugins available, and most tool providers support WooCommerce out of the box. For support and maintenance, I give it a five. WooCommerce does not provide any support. As a result, you have to be good at problem solving and finding your own solutions. Now, because WordPress updates so often, you may encounter plugin incompatibilities and other technical issues. E-commerce plugin number three is Equid. The Equid e-commerce plugin shares many of the same characteristics as the BigCommerce plugin and that it won't slow down your site. Equid is a fully hosted platform, which means that they take care of all the technical aspects of your online store, so you don't have to worry about security, uptime, et cetera. All of your products and transactions are served on Equid servers, which is completely independent of your site. And similar to BigCommerce, you can run your site in a subfolder, which is great for SEO. Now, Equid's only SEO drawback is that you can't change your URL slug, which is a nice to have feature, but not a deal breaker. Now, the best part about Equid is that it's 100% free to use for up to 10 products on your site. However, as your site grows, you will eventually have to sign up for a paid plan that starts at $15 a month. Now, the main downside to using Equid is that it does not have good third-party software tool support. So for example, integrating Equid with the leading email marketing platform, Klaviyo, requires you to use Zapier to glue the two tools together. Now, the lack of third-party tool support can be a big problem if you want to run a fully featured online store. However, if you are on a limited budget and not tech savvy, Equid is actually an economical solution that will allow you to sell online without bogging down your WordPress site. So here's how I rate Equid on a scale of one to 10. Ease of use, I give it a nine. Equid is extremely easy to use and set up. Functionality, I give it an eight. Out of the box, Equid offers all the necessary features to start selling online. Now their feature set is not as extensive as BigCommerce, but it is more than adequate. Price, I give it a nine. Equid is free when selling up to 10 products. In addition, the paid plans are significantly cheaper than BigCommerce and you aren't charged based on revenue. Third-party apps and integrations, I give it a five. Equid actually has very poor third-party tool support. So for example, if you wanna be able to drop ship or use print on demand, your options are gonna be limited. Support and maintenance, I give it an eight. All the paid plans provide live chat support, and on the higher plans, 
you will receive phone support in addition to customization and design help. E-commerce plugin number four is the Shopify WordPress plugin. Now, most people are not aware, but Shopify offers a $9 a month plan that allows you to add simple buy buttons to any existing website that you own, including WordPress. Now, on their light Shopify pricing plan, Shopify handles all the heavy lifting for your online store without slowing down your site. And here's how it works. You basically sign up for Shopify and create a product for sale. Then you generate a special buy button code on your product listing and add it to your WordPress page. This buy button creates a mini online store which connects directly to Shopify. Now on the surface, Shopify's buy buttons behave much like the BigCommerce and Equid plugins, but there's one key difference. The Shopify buy button redirects users off of your website during the checkout process to complete the purchase, which can be confusing. Meanwhile, with the BigCommerce WordPress plugin, the visitor is on your site the entire time and the checkout process is nicely integrated with your existing WordPress blog. Now this distinction is subtle, but it makes a big difference to the customer experience. Shopify's WordPress solution is literally just a buy button, whereas BigCommerce and Equid are integrated solutions. Now overall, Shopify's WordPress solution made this list because Shopify is the most popular fully hosted platform in the world, and it's well supported by third-party developers. But here's how I rate the Shopify WordPress plugin on a scale of one to 10. Ease of use, I give it a seven. Configuring products on Shopify is simple. However, you may have to cut and paste pieces of code back and forth from your website, which is kind of clunky. Functionality, I give it an eight. Out of the box, Shopify offers all the necessary features to start selling online. However, you may need to pay for extra plugins to add functionality to your shop. For price, I give it a six. Shopify's light plan is only nine bucks a month, but it offers very limited functionality. Third-party apps and integrations, I give it a 10. Like WooCommerce, Shopify has excellent third-party support, and almost every cutting-edge feature arrives on Shopify first. For support and maintenance, I give it a 10. Shopify offers full support on all of its paid plans. And then finally, e-commerce plugin number five is Easy Digital Downloads. Now, every WordPress plugin up to this point has been evaluated strictly based on selling physical products. But most of these plugins are overkill if you only want to sell digital products. So even though WooCommerce, BigCommerce, Shopify, and Equid all offer support for selling digital products, Easy Digital Downloads has a much cleaner interface for selling PDFs, eBooks, audio clips, and short videos online. Now, the best part is that Easy Digital Downloads is free and you can get started selling right away. If you need tech support, you can pay for a subscription, which offers full customer support and additional features and updates. For example, with a paid plan, you also get access to extensions like email marketing, extra payment gateways, subscriptions, and more. Now, if you're comparing Easy Digital Downloads to WooCommerce, which are both free, the primary difference is that WooCommerce was originally designed for physical products, and the ability to sell digital products was added much later. Meanwhile, Easy Digital Downloads was designed from the ground up to sell digital products. So as a result, Easy Digital Downloads is a much faster plugin and won't bog down your site as much as WooCommerce. It's also easier to use because it doesn't try to do everything. Also, Easy Digital Downloads works with almost every WordPress theme, which hasn't always been the case with WooCommerce. So here's how I write Easy Digital Downloads. Ease of use, I give it a nine. For functionality, I give it a seven. Out of the box, EDD offers all the necessary functionality you need to start selling digital products. However, you might have to pay for additional apps like email marketing and select payment gateways. For price, I give it a 10. It's free. For third-party apps and integrations, I give it an eight. Like WooCommerce, EDD has a pretty extensive plugin library, not as large as WooCommerce, but more than adequate. And for support and maintenance, I give it a nine. They have over 60,000 users and it's a well-supported plugin. So the million dollar question is which WordPress e-commerce plugin should you choose? Now that depends on your budget and your technical ability. So here's some questions just to ask yourself when making your choice. If you only wanna sell digital products online, the choice is simple, go with easy digital downloads. If you are tech averse with a decent sized budget, go with big commerce. If you're tech averse with a smaller budget, go with Equid. If you're looking for a free WordPress plugin and you're reasonably tech savvy, go with WooCommerce. If you want full control over the source code and your platform, go with WooCommerce. The only reason you should ever use Shopify for WordPress is if there's a plugin or app that you need that is not offered anywhere else. Good luck with your decision. Hope you enjoyed this video. Now, if you like what you saw, there's actually a lot more where that came from if you subscribe to my channel below. And if you are interested in learning how to sell physical products online, then click over here and take my free six day mini course where I'll walk you through everything that you need to know to get started in e-commerce. Thanks for watching.